Hey everybody, it's Jamie here, and today we are staying at Oakley Hall, a luxury manor house hotel in Hampshire. 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 I'm going to show you the grounds, our room, and what you can expect to feast on in the restaurant and bar during this festive period. But before we go any further, please don't forget to like, follow, and turn on those notifications for my weekly travel vlogs. Your support is very much appreciated. Oakley Hall is located in the beautiful Hampshire countryside and is just a stone's throw from the fabulous Bombay Gin Distillery which is well worth a visit. The hotel dates back to 1795 and has links to the celebrated novelist Jane Austen who lived in the nearby village of Steventon. Over the years this Georgian manor has been used as a boarding school and also as a wedding and conference venue. After a very significant £4 million restoration project in 2014, Oakley Hall was restored to its country house hotel roots you see today. Oakley has 50 bedrooms ranging from deluxe, executive, suites and even a cottage. Here's a look at our room, which is a standard double. You'll find bottled water and fresh milk in your fridge. With a double A rosette restaurant and acres of beautiful grounds to explore, Oakley Hall Hotel is a great venue for a cozy getaway. With one of the largest event spaces in Hampshire, it's no surprise that Oakley Hall is well known for hosting weddings for those lovers celebrating their vows and looking for the perfect excuse for a good old knees up, um, Mother Brown. Let's head to the 1795 Bar and Lounge to see what is on offer. And here's our experience at the award-winning Glass House Restaurant. According to the owners at Oakley Hall, they follow a field-to-fork philosophy, which means they pride themselves on using local produce sourced from within a 50-mile radius. In fact, some of the produce even comes from their own kitchen garden. Right, so we really did enjoy our meal at the Glass House. Good menu, well executed, great service and a nice wine list. So yeah, a win for us. Take my word for it, the blackberry sorbet on this dish was absolutely stunning. After a very good night's sleep, we woke up to this beautiful sunrise. Breakfast was included in our overnight stay. Unfortunately, this was the only part of our stay that didn't quite work for us. Service was somewhat lacking this morning and inattentive. Breakfast was surprisingly bland and the scrambled eggs just a wet, soggy mess. What's more, there were no staff around to resolve the problem. And there you have it, our experience of staying at Oakley Hall Hotel. So what do you think folks? Drop your comments below and I will get back to you. In the meantime, don't forget to follow Travel Blog Jamie on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. God bless you all.